another great practical, pra practical practical or practical household kitchen appliance is a skillet. We've got from Dash the eight inch mini electric skillet, but this is, let's see, it's maybe small, but it's mighty. This has that true glide technology. So it's that nonstick coating. It's on, are you kidding me? $22.95. Brand new to us, two interest-free credit card payments, three colors. You can either choose the black, the red, or the navy. Um, and, oh, you, you do you have a steak in there? I do. Sorry, I got so sidetracked got by distracted. the smell. You're like my dog. You're like, I, was like, mm, squirrel? I smell meat. <laughs> Squirrel. <laughs> okay, this may be called a mini electric skillet, it's, but it's nice. really not very mini. So, and, the, and there's so many things I want to say about the okay. name because it's called an electric skillet, but I'm searing a steak. Look at the gorgeous caramelization of this. And the reason is this has got some power. I've got an electric dial, a rotary dial, so I can manually move it. And I love not having to be able to, you know, get glasses, squint at a digital thing, yeah. figure out why my finger isn't working on the button. This is so easy. But the high on the Dash electric skillet is a a serious sear. It is 450 degrees. Okay. So I can take my big strip steak, I can put a big sear on it right here on my counter. I love my depth here. I've got four inches depth of cooking, so it's not spraying mm. all over. And it is so neat and compact. Then I'm gonna turn it down to medium, which is still a boil. I added my mushrooms, my onions, a little bit of gravy. I'm gonna put my glass lid on, which is vented, and let this simmer mm -hmm. a little Mm. and make the most okay. amazing gravy possible. So dinner for one, and actually it fits two steaks very easily, right there on my countertop. It's just so convenient and portable. A lot of us have been uh, going on trips. You're hiking, you're vacationing, you're camping, you're RVing, or maybe you just live alone. You're like, you know what? I don't need all that extra, uh, you know, cookware. I just want one simple thing. This is a great way to get it done. Well, and this is a way to get dinner on the table without a lot of hassle. So yeah. I put in shrimp and sausage, okay. some onions and peppers, did another sear, on high because again I'm getting up to 450 on my high setting now I added some liquid and in this case I did kind of a, a milky alfredo sauce a little bit of Cajun spices I put my pasta in dry it is raw not pre-cooked so one pot cooking here that's mm -hmm. a pretty good capacity that is a quart of penne or uh, ziti shrimp mm -hmm. no butter or why well, can't I think of the, the name bow tie bow tie thank you bow goodness tie. coffee well, needs you know, to be on the show it's 9 30 in the morning <laughs> bow tie pasta with with sausage and shrimp, one pot cooking. Again, I'm gonna turn it down to medium, I'm gonna let it boil, and I've got a full quart capacity. I'm eight inches across, which again, holds two burgers, holds two steaks. The four inches of depth gives sure. me the ability to do the one pot cooking. Once again, I pop on the lid. This is where the magic is. We love our electric you. skillets for things like pancakes, mm -hmm. for things like French toast, but think out of the box here because I love the shape of this. You've got enough depth that you can use it as you would a pan on the stove, but yet I don't have to worry about the burner being too yeah. hot. I can control it. I don't have to worry about whether I'm not heated up to where I want it to. I and can all you need it. is an outlet, right? Just That's plugs it. into a standard outlet. Anywhere you and are. And then you're getting the lid included, which I love that it's clear and it's got that cool touch handle on the top. What about cleaning this? Like, how do, is it? Oh my gosh, I'm going to show you because <laughs> okay. we're going to pull out pizza. Okay. It is the Dash True Glide nonstick. So, nonstick being the key. Look at this. What? I mean, that just slid right out of here. So remember, your temperature control goes all the way down to low. So okay. you can do a gentle bake if you want to. We took store-bought pizza mm -hmm. dough, though. It was fresh. Mm -hmm. Squished it out into the pan, put a little bit of spray, Ooh, a little bit of oil smart. on the bottom is all you need. Then you can start making eight inch pizzas. My family loves individual pizzas. You know what I don't love? Turning on the oven for something that is only eight inches wide. Or if you've ever tried to microwave a pizza, oh, it's so it's mushy. It's like rubber don't and do that. mushy yeah, and don't gross. Do that. So instead, I've got a good, fluffy, yummy pizza. You can make it, you know, specific to anybody's dietary or taste needs. Mm -hmm. You asked about cleanup, everything that is coming out of here, literally, look at Incredible. the dash. I mean, this is that True Glide non-stick. It wipes right out. Stay cool and are handles. These cool? Yeah, I was gonna yep. say, are the handles, they stay cool? Handles are stay That's cool. Awesome. In fact, it stays cool all the way around to the bottom, so that if I need to move it somewhere, maybe I'm doing an artichoke dip, taking it somewhere, I can grab it from the bottom and still transport. And you do have a one-year warranty on this, so, and it's super lightweight. I'm gonna have some pizza. Um, we've got steak going, we've got shrimp and pasta going, we just made a pizza. It is 
breakfast time for most of us, a part of the country. So is this like a, a frittata? This is a frittata. Mm. And again, like many of us in the morning, okay. no time to go to the oven. Watch what I can do with the nonstick. All I did was turn that upside down. Why am I able to maneuver and touch this since it was just cooking? Because I'm stay cool on the sides and right. around to the bottom. Look at how easily that comes out. And even, like the it, cooking is totally even. Exactly what you would want in terms of the brownness. Mm -hmm. I did this one with some cheese, with some spinach, with some peppers on top, and it's perfectly cooked. But again, I did this all right here on the table. To me, this is the perfect size. It really I'll is. be honest, when I first saw this, and because it is labeled mini electric skillet, uh -huh. I thought, oh my gosh, we're only gonna be doing you know, one of this and one of that, and it's so individualized. That's frittata for four. I can do an eight inch pizza. So I'm thinking more meals than just a sandwich. Okay. But when you want that electric skillet to do mm -hmm. the perfect grilled cheese, or do something Something individual quesadillas are yeah. a very common go-to in fact I was making one at 10 30 last night for my teenage son uh, teenage boys have a third meal at in the <laughs> evening <laughs> there's the pre-dinner there's the dinner and there's the third dinner and so I go to quesadillas because they're quick I was gonna say you don't tell them just go get some box of cereal I've tried that okay. they, they need right. real protein and real food so and I can pop my quesadilla I can steam it I can use it for crunchy but in the end all I'm gonna do is pop in my controller there and the only thing you have to do is push it in far enough so it clicks okay and you know you're good to go Go. And plug it in. And, this, and plug it in. In this case, I'm going to dial to low. I do this on the stove. It gets too crunchy. I forget about it. The cheese doesn't melt. This is perfectly even heating. I love cooking with electric. When you talk about even heating, with that pizza, every single spot on this slice of pizza is the same temperature. Yes. Right? There's not like a cold spot in the middle. There's not like a portion that was burned. And now you've moved, are those mussels? Yes, we have steamed oh mussels gosh. and a little bit of wine. Again, think about what you can do when you're not using the stove. I can keep this the exact same temperature the entire time I cook so that I'm not gonna run out of liquid. I can watch until every little shell opens because I can see through my glass lid. But again, look at capacity. It's got a one quart capacity. Dash That's is so lot. smart and they've given us this depth mm -hmm. so I can do things like steam. I can do things like like my casseroles, and I can do it right here on the countertop. All right, so here's the thing, you guys. We are getting busy. This is brand new. Yes, it says mini, but it is mini and mighty. You have the choice of the blue, which I think we're calling navy, the red or the black. All you need is an outlet, so you can take this with you in the camper, in the RV, the apartment, the dorm. It is small and compact, but it will cook a lot of food. Get it home today for $11.48 once you select your color. We give you 30 days to test it out. That's 30, let's see, 30 times, that's... 90 meals. That's a lot right? of cooking. That's 90 meals that you could make for you, maybe your spouse, maybe your kids. Um, it's perfect for a party of one or a party of two. Or if you do have, like you said, when your kids want that late night meal, you don't want to turn on the oven. You don't want to take out all the cookware. Just do something that's easy Quick that has easy. easy cleanup because it's got that non-stick. It does. And I like this for lunches for moms at home too. But look at the color. Look at the caramelization mm. on these pork chops. This is not what you'd expect from an electric skillet. Dash has done an amazing job making are high 450 degrees so that I can get this gorgeous sear. I can get the caramelization on my apples. This is where the flavor is, you guys. Those are the good tasty bits when you cook. And usually, sometimes you need a cast iron pan to get that. Yeah. Dash has given us such a great little skillet. We can do it right here. You mentioned nonstick. Take a look in here. This was apples. This was pork. This was onion. This was messy. And now... Wipe I'm literally going to wipe it. And this is not even a damp towel. And that is a dry towel. So very, very easy to clean. You n definitely don't have any uh, issues there. What about frying? I can actually do a shallow fry here. I didn't even Four think inches about that. deep. Think about it. If you wanted to pop some shrimp in, do a quick fried shrimp. We've actually gone ahead and fried our chicken strips here because my kids like them extra crispy, crunchy. Mm -hmm. Put them on a quick bed of greens. But this is because you have that even cooking. Remember, we're 350 degrees. So there's there is no problem setting it to medium and keeping it at that exact temperature. I love the cl color coding of the low, medium, high. You can't get it wrong. It's totally lightweight. You're doing my favorite. Is that, is that cauliflower rice? This is rice? cauliflower rice. And you're rice. making like a stir fry yep. type thing? And you want to get it a little bit Great. crunchy, right? Because you're trying yep. to have that feeling like you're having real fried rice. So I buy it fresh. I buy it already riced, as they call it, in the shredded form. I'm going to go ahead and put a quick sear on it on high and make fried rice.
And I do have to show you my favorite thing of all. We have baked a shepherd's pie. Mm. I could take this on the go to someone's house, plug it in when I get there, and still be able to serve right there. I didn't need to heat up my oven, but this is shepherd's pie for like six. That's a lot Isn't of Isn't that food. a lot of food? So don't let Minnie turn you off. This is a mighty electric skillet that we can do Incredible. everything with. Stephanie's not going anywhere. I'm